Evening pop pickers. So tonight I'm going to do a piano tutorial of the Stone Roses song I Am The Resurrection. So let's see how we get on. Uh, if you do like the end result, then please feel free to download the piano album of the Roses debut, which also contains this song, and you can find that on Spotify and that lot. So let's go. So I'm playing this in the key of C, and we'll start with Ian Brown's vocals, which are played on the right hand as follows. So that's the first half of the verse, second half is identical, so you just repeat that. Now we'll move on to the left hand which plays the bass notes. Rather than playing Manny's bass line which goes something like this. This piano version is a lot simpler because it's just a one finger, one note bass at the start of each chord like this. Again, the second half of the verse is a repeat of the first half, so you just repeat that. So putting the left hand together with the right hand now sounds like this. To give it a slightly fuller sound, I use two notes at the top, a bit like harmony notes. And on the bass, I hit two octaves at the same time. So the verse now sounds like this. Next is the mid bit of the song, which is a bit like a bridge between the two verses where Ian Brown sings the following melody. Manny's bass from there if you want to include that. So onto the bass of the midsection. Again, we'll start with the one finger one note bass line to keep it simple the bass follows the chords which are a minor f and c Now for the second verse, this is played differently to the first one for more variety, but I'll give you some tips how to get it sounding like this in a bit.
So on the left hand, rather than playing one note bass, I play three notes for each chord in, in a little flurry. To work out those three notes, you take the bass note of the chord, which in this case is a C. Then find the octave, high C. Then find what I call middle note, which is always the eighth note up, in this case G. And then you play the three notes of a little scale. Same rule, next chord. Same rule for mid bit chords. Now for the chorus. For now, I'll strip it right back to one note playing on right and left hand. And Ian Brown sings the following melody. The left hand just plays bass notes of the chorus chords. Hope you enjoyed that tutorial, pop pickers, and I uh, hope you got something out of it. And happy playing, and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.